Hi again everybody, I'm back again. So today I'm just going to be taking a look at one of the watches that I've had for quite some time. I believe this watch is actually maybe the very, the fourth watch that I ever um, purchased or received. Um, so I've had this watch for, for almost a year now. Um, this is kind of one of the early watches that I got when I first really just got into watches um, really at the beginning of the year. Really the tail end of last year. So right around Christmas um, is around when I got into watches last year. So um, let's take a look. So obviously this is a Belova. I believe I'm saying it right. It's a Belova watch um, that I received. So this, here's the manual. Um, this is the box that it came in. And this is actually still the only Belova watch that I own um, at the present time. Um, so let's go ahead and take that out. Um, so we take a look at it. This is um, what they call their, um, this is one of the Marine Star watches, I believe. It's kind of out of focus there. I'm not sure what's going on there doesn't want to focus no focus no focus and there we go okay now it looks a little bit better there so yeah taking a look at the face uh, kind of has like a gold color face with some black uh, I guess screws or imprints in there uh, really really nice design um, so uh, uh, fortunately for me I, I got this one um, before I knew about um, there was a watch watch <laughs> gang exchange piece um, involved with the subscription that you can participate in and uh, really before I understood like the real prices of a lot of these watches um, so I bought this one actually at a retail um, I believe from like a Macy's but um, it was on sale um, but I think this one had a tag of uh, let's see um, the time when I got it the tag was $4.99 um, I, I didn't pay $4.99 but um, that's kind of what their retail price is I got it for what I thought was a, a good deal at the time they had a sale going on so let's take a look at it a little bit deeper. Um, so it has kind of like this um, rubber slash, um, I think it's actually silicone, like silicone strap um, that's attached to it. Let's get that out, pop that out. There you go. So it's pretty flexible. Um, it's actually pretty comfortable as well um, when, I, when I wear it. Um, so I have the two adjustment straps. Take a look around on the back. Um, not too much, pretty, pretty clean surface. Um, stainless steel, water resistant. And that's pretty much it. It's not much on the back going on. Um, take a look back at the front. Um, so this one is a chronograph. So um, if you press the little top button there, you see the big hand with the red on it, that one starts ticking away. Um, so if I tap it again, it'll pause. If I press the second button, it rips all the way around. It goes back to the beginning. Um, the crown um, adjusts pretty easily. Um, so um, it has a date adjustment down there. So it's the 31st. Oh, yeah, it went to the right date. Um, and then you can pull it out another notch and swivel it around there. Works pretty well. Um, so pretty nice watch, um, uh, at least in, in my my opinion. Um, so like I said, this is actually one of the nicer watches that I um, purchased early on um, as I started getting into watches. Because um, like my very first watch game watch, um, when I compared it to like the other only other well I actually up to that time when I joined watch game I had purchased two watches and period in my lifetime um, had never worn the first one that I bought I never wore it um, even to today I still have never worn that watch um, and it's a citizen echo drive um, it doesn't really seem like it worked that well whatever power in it or battery power um, that the light generate um, it's not really working that well anymore and then the second watch I ever got was a uh, Vince Camuto that I that I bought for myself. So that watch I wore, and, and then I signed up for Watch Gang. And that very first watch I got, I was like, man, this is a this watch is kind of trash compared <laughs> to the one that I had bought myself. Um, when I compare the quality of that that I got for my very first Watch Gang watch to the quality of the Vince Camuto watch that I, that I purchased outside of that. Um, so like the next step is that I bought this one, but then as time went on the watch game even the regular subscription The quality of the watches got a lot better as time went on and then I later got black subscription Those watches have been um, decent quality as well So I've been, been happy with pretty happy with the subscription It's just kind of it's got off to a rough, rough rocky start a little bit with the the Omax watch that I initially received like when I put it in my hand it, it felt pretty cheap in comparison to like something like this or um, the Viscomuto watch, um, but uh, like I said, as time went on, they, the watch got a lot better. Um, so yeah, this is a Belova Marine Star watch. Um, it has the time date, chronograph, and the gold, kind of gold plated face, and this 
silicone rubberized type of strap. All right, um, like, subscribe, share, comment, let me know your thoughts, and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.